A pretty frustrating day at the office for you, Russ. Yeah, it was. Um, yeah, very frustrating first half. We just didn't get going. Very poor start. Two really, really poor goals. Um, should have been avoided. <coughs> and <coughs> aside of that, we didn't create anything as well, really. So, yeah, very, very frustrating first half. Again, a bit like Wednesday night from that sort of things. And I just don't understand. It's quite hard to understand, actually. Do you know what I mean? The mindset, how you can come out like that and then the second half come out and actually go all guns blazing. And to be fair, I thought, really, there's only one side in it second half and we've had enough ch chances today. Probably score four or five and not, I'm not talking about 25 yard chances where you've got, I'm talking about one v ones, three headers, things like tap into the fast stick and things like that and we've just not got in the end of them. So yeah, very, very frustrating day today and uh, I don't think uh, we've done ourselves justice today, to be honest with you. A lot of injury problems before the game, and then we lost Michael very early on. Must <coughs> that obviously upset the apple cart a bit? Yeah, yeah. Obviously, we, uh, we were hoping that Tom would be fit, um, and Hamo. They went out there, and obviously they just weren't weren't right today. Um, we took a gamble with Michael, big Michael, and not nothing to do with the goal, things and that sort of thing, but it was actually his movement after the goal when he went to the side we could just see he wasn't right, so rather than cause um, another goal and things like that, um, because he couldn't his mobility, we just decided to like, take him off straight away from that so they can get some fresh legs in there. So um to be fair to them, I thought Jason done well today mm -hmm. for, um, for his second start. Hard game to come into. Um missing uh, first team regulars really which was steady steady for the ship a little bit. And also, I thought Tegan, once he settled down, down done well as well, really. So, and there, there was no reflection of why we took him off. We just took him off, really, to get um, Stefan and Dejan on, because they've scored goals for us um, this season. And obviously, we were we were chasing the game. So, no reflection on, on the way Tegan played that we take him off, really, from that side. And I thought that the guys who came on actually made a real impact. I mean, <laughs> Dejan had a chance right at the start of the second half. And... Throughout that half, we were we were really creating stuff. It was just we just couldn't get it in in the end, was it? Yeah, we're still with some frustrating passages of play um, where we probably could have got our head up and played someone else in a little bit easier rather than trying to go past another player or um, take another pass things like that. But I thought when we actually did pass and move, there was some really good intricate football and we created some good chances. I, mean, I think the move for Dajon's chance was excellent football. It was about five or six really quick passes in the space of about twenty yards of, of play and. Um, I thought, we'd, I thought we'd pass the ball much better, and we, but more importantly, I thought we had more desire mm -hmm. and we just had more vigour about us. And I thought we were actually were pressing people. Um, everything we had second half, um, we didn't really have first half. I'll be honest with you, and I felt that was the difference. If we'd started like that, then I think we'd be sitting here with a different result, but we're not, so we've got to learn from that again. Again, they're a very, very young squad. We've got not many players there above the age of 22 uh -huh. and they've got to learn that they can't just turn on and off application like a light switch really you have to work hard every single time especially in a league like this because you can play the top side or the bottom side and if you don't work hard then you'll get beaten you will do and I think we got punished today for um, a not great first half and um, the two chances or three chances they've had they scored two goals from them and then we're, it's an uphill mountain from there, really. So, so yeah, we blessed ourselves too much today. We still thought we could have got some of it from the uh, chances we created, but wasn't to be for that, unfortunately. Okay, thanks, Ross. Cheers, Baz. Thank you.